Hey, it's EJ Bobo 3, and let's begin. What's going on, right? It's your boy EJ Bobo 3, and we are back with some more fun DD stuff. Now, for anyone who is a player of DD, like I am, um, you know that there is stuff that you can do to tweak your own game. No two games of DD are alike. And one thing that always comes out that you can do is something called homebrewing. Now, for anyone who doesn't know, homebrewing is the art of creating your own monster, your own item, your own whatever the fuck, that's not in traditional, like the D&D rules. Whatever you create, and you make it like an official thing in your group, that is homebrew. D&D Beyond is a website that like hosts a bunch of homebrew. Uh, so if, let's say, you want to, I don't know, make a giant, a uh, giant demon woman to stomp you out if you're into that I'm not but you could do it so on D&D Beyond there is a section where you can explore a different homebrew made by people in the D&D space so I decided to drag my buddy Danny along who is one of the people who got me into D&D uh, and decided to show him some of the worst homebrew that we could possibly find and just laugh at some of the insane monster creation that people have made and it was an entire entire barrel last it was such a great time anyway guys before i dive into it if you are excited for this video and you like it and you want to see more let me know best way to let me know is to drop a like leave a comment hit subscribe hit the bell all the fight buttons down below i love appreciate you all so much and let's get into this bad homebrew danny how the hell are you well uh, there's a three day old piece of fried chicken sitting on my end table and it's staring at me Perfect. What do you know about homebrew content? I decided to drag my friend along to react to some of the weirdest, terrible homebrew that I could find on this lovely little website, D&D Beyond. Are you excited, good sir? It's like half-eaten, and a lot of the skin is taken off, and it's getting kind of stale. <laughs> I should probably throw it away. It's looking at me right now. I agree, my third monster is also a Tarrasque. <laughs> so we are on the monsters tab, um, I'll probably end up switching in between, but I already have it sorted to lowest. We got a, we got a staggering negative nine on the score for a dark ghoul. I'm already seeing Freddy Fazbear, which is fantastic. What <laughs> the fuck so, is Freddy oh, Fazbear? Wait, hold on, wait a minute. All right, so dark ghoul is at the very bottom. Yes, this is the this is the worst one, according right. to D and D Beyond the community. Armor class fifteen. Okay. <laughs> Natural armor. The medium undead creature. Chaotic evil. Natural. Um, yeah. Dark ghoul. What? 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 Oh, ten speed. It can fly. Of course. <laughs> what? What is Holy uh? Shit. What's making this a bad creature? Why is it so low? Why is it the bottom? Hmm? The ghoul rolls every turn for a for a one or a twenty. If rolled, the target player is paralyzed or possessed, or loses his or her turn until the ghoul that hurt them is killed. Carries a great oh. sword. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what? The, well, there's your fucking there's your answer. <laughs> so if you <laughs> so if the fucking DM rolls a nat one or nat twenty, it's just like you don't get a turn this round. Sorry. <laughs> Holy no. What a... That slay action is insane. <laughs> they're just... They're, they just made a really dumb function. Yeah. That's why it's... So... Yeah, it got... I, I think that's bad, but I don't know if that's And right the above bottom. it, Beluga Whale. Beluga Whale, let's go. That's a lot Large of Large swarm of gargantuan monsters. You get it? Because it's a whale? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Fuck all the stats. <laughs> it can bellow. Oh my god, this, hell yes. This, this is an attack where the beluga bellows. It can reach up to a range of seven or 275 feet. Mm. Even for above water, if you hear it, you immediately take 1d4 plus 3 damage. You cannot hear each other for one turn. <laughs> Get, uh, Get fucked if you want to communicate. So even if, like, this thing is all the way off in the middle of the ocean, if you are, like, near the sea and you hear it, you're, you're just dead for a turn. Alright. Oh. I know why it's low. It's a fucking beluga whale. It's a whale. Also, it has x-ray vision. <laughs> it has outcasting. Actually, <laughs> actually, actually, Amazing. can I say this? I don't think it's a bad creature. Yeah. Literally, the, the spell casting, the idea of a whale casting, like, Wall of Force at me. That is... I couldn't even be mad. That is hilarious. <laughs> so I kind of love that. Do you think he's wearing the hat? 
I hope he's I wearing just, the hat. I just made a new monster for my future campaign. Well, whoever made this, congrats, you inspired him. Oh, uh, cool. here we fucking go. Freddy Five Bear. Freddy Five Bear. Armor class 15 oh. material plate. Mm. Oh, this is... This person is... This is not done. Action name. Enter the description no. for your action. <laughs> Microphone. <laughs> Holy bludgeoning damage. You get smacked in the head with a fucking microphone. Its reaction name is enter the description for your action. I, I love when they're half completed. This makes me insanely happy. I love it so much. <laughs> I'm sorry. Actual Chuck yep, I, we ex Exact same brain cell. Actual <laughs> Chuck. Six. Wait, hold on. Speed 200 <laughs> feet. Fly 100 feet. Burrow 200 feet. Climb. <laughs> 200 feet, so I'm 200 feet. <laughs> 30, 30, 30, 30, 30. <laughs> he has every immunity. His of damage course. immunities is every elemental damage type. Holy fuck, 690 health. <laughs> Actions roundhouse kick. Gargantuan the player should grab to make a dexterity saving throw of 18 or higher. If failed, you would take 15 d8 bludgeoning damage. That's so live, much fucking damage. Live, live grenade. Live grenade. He chucks a bomb, reaching 120 <laughs> feet. If you are hit, you take 4d10 explosion damage. This is the greatest thing. This is um, dude. This is amazing. You know, I got. I think I got to put an actual Chuck Norris somewhere in my in my next campaign. <laughs> if you do, I'm getting up out of the table and walking out of the house. Hold on. <laughs> legendary action name and a description for your legendary action. He he transcends legendary action. He doesn't need him. He's redacted. Proficiency plus nine. Good. Christ. No, I just want to gargant gargantuan um, unknown. Any alignment, so he could be anything. <clears throat> Great. Hit points. Six hundred ninety. Yeah, six hundred ninety fucking hit points. I'm Good luck class. doing anything. I'm sorry, can we point out the fucking 50 athletics? <laughs> you know? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> that That is the best thing I've ever seen. I, I don't know why these are the worst. These are really fucking good. Okay, AC, A10C Warthog. <laughs> <laughs> 25 titanium coating. Goddamn. Uh, it, it has a staggering 500 less hit points than Chuck Norris. This is either a tank or like a fucking... It has to be a tank. Bomber, or or a bomber plane. It's actions. <laughs> Range weapon <laughs> attack plus 32 to hit. Range 4,000 to 12... 4,000 to 12,000 feet. Can you imagine you're in like a medieval tavern, right? Is that the scene? You know, and you're just like enjoying yourself. Oh, you're looking at the tavern wenches. There's like some dwarves posted up on one side of the tavern. Having an the ale. Tavern the bringing, yeah, bringing the tavern wench bringing you an ale. The bartenders like telling the adventurers across the tavern about recent gossips and everybody's feasting and drinking on ale and mead and you know dining and everything. And then you just hear like. AC-130 inbound, and like, just, like, somebody got a kill streak in the middle of, like, Vandalin. <laughs> you know what this, like, reads like to me? This reads like uh, if you DM'd for, like, four-year-olds, and one of them just really got into, like, the military, and was like, I want the Warthog to go across, across the tavern. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, whoa. Whoa. A aim 9x Sidewinder, plus 350 to hit, range 100, I think that's 116,000 feet, hit, I can't even, that's not a number, force, blood, plus force damage, plus piercing damage, look at those fucking numbers, that's like 1 million D8s, <laughs> this is just nonsense, it has flares and a chaff, Eric, it has plus 280 to hit, Oh, you know. 350. It doesn't need stat boosts. This whole thing is just ridiculous. I love it. The staff. What is the staff? <laughs> it's just. It's neutral evil, medium humanoid. <laughs> Will only become hostile at night or if provoked. Nah, this is my favorite so far. He, It's just a guy and he shows up and he's like, motherfuckers call me the staff. <laughs> and then he beats your ass. I, I was thinking it's either gotta be a nickname or it's a literal fucking stick that gets angry no. at night. 
It's a big ass brolic dude, and he shows up in the middle of the town, and he's like, "Motherfuckers call me the staff," and then he beats you up. Holy! It has one armor. It has thirty strength and one everything else. So it's the strongest being in the universe. Strange biology. It's just skin all the way through. I'm not engaging. That. No. <laughs> Nope. No. Nope. Nope. Oh my god. Dies god. Oh no. Well. <laughs> Everything, everyone, all at once. <laughs> what is it? Medium unknown. And that's just. Is that every race that has ever existed? <laughs> Typically lawful good. Oh, thank god. But it's, it's only troglodyte. <laughs> <laughs> Third is across the board. Actions unknown. Reactions unknown. Plus nine proficiency bonus. When oh. they like have all of the numbers maxed out, it just reminds me of like the gamer tags of like Ryhards and GTA lobbies and the gamers of yore. Yeah. Do you think that this is an actual god, like a DD, like a D20, biblically accurate D20? No, I think this was like your unemployed friend on a Tuesday. <laughs> Doing shit on D and D Beyond for no fucking reason. They just wanted to max out everything. Oh my yeah. good lord! That's what I think this is. Imagine having to roll a thousand D twenties. <laughs> Imagine spending your time making this. Holy shit! I couldn't. Abominator, Obamaton, Abyss Destroyer. Obamaton. Obama. I hope it's Obama. Twenty-two Obama. all except for magic. Okay, we're starting off doing something. Uh. Mm -hmm. Seems pretty fucking boring. It's also immune to everything, again. That is a hundred thousand feet tall. <laughs> it's like the size of a Tarrasque. It's like a fucking robot Tarrasque. He is too slow to react when trying to react prone for next attack. Was that English? Was that a sentence? <laughs> Bo <laughs> bonus actions none except his legendary action reactions sometimes. Mega punch the ro Mega- oh my god, the fucking punctuation. Where is it? Mega punch the robot punches with giant feet. You can't apply resistance or immunity to this attack. You're gonna fucking die no matter what. Holy shit. Um, the fucking on, alphabet? <laughs> Fight the alphabet, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Crackers in, in my suit. suit. <laughs> so, 21. 500 hit points. Great. It has a 19 oh charisma. <laughs> no, I'm always skipping to the thing that catches my eye. The alphabet sings a very annoying song that sounds like A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V I N Z. I and no my A B C D. Next time won't you? Next time won't you roll with me? Murder you! Holy shit! Every case that can hear the alphabet must take a DC 25 wisdom save or take 18 D10 psychic damage. The creature is also frightened. It's scared of letters. Tiny mm. monster. It's also tiny. <laughs> the abomination the was birthed in the legendary dungeon known as preschool. <laughs> All right. <laughs> it has since escaped and bothered anybody who knows their ABCs. If sighted, you should put your hands to your ears and flee. It throw letters, range weapon attack, plus nine to hit. Another broken ass range. One target. Hit 55 or 10 D10 psychic damage. On a hit, choose a random letter. The affected target can't use that letter in their speech for the next 10 minutes. What? <laughs> what? I knew, I knew there was a reason we went to the third page, and it was because that we now know that you could get TPK'd by the alphabet. Oh my God! Uh, you can lose to letters. I, I'm honestly, I respect it. Like. It's so dumb, but, oh my god, any language that has an alphabet, so any language. We we have to stop or we're going to figure out that somebody made a character, like a, a, a you know, <laughs> a sheet for like, pre, like, like AP trig. <laughs> Someone made a monster based on their homework. Did you learn anything from this? N not in the slightest. Fantastic. Well, now we have inspiration for our next campaign, so I think that is the perfect area to end this. <laughs>
Um. Holy shit. I, I need to, um. I gotta go throw away this chicken. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I love so much. If you enjoyed this and you want some more DD videos, let me know down below. Don't, you don't guys... like. Don't subscribe. <laughs> don't, yes. don't like, don't subscribe, and definitely don't share. Mm hmm. Absolutely. Um. Stay away. <laughs> You guys are amazing, guys. Beautiful, guys. Wonderful, fantastic. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye.